Hi everyone, my name is Andrew Cooley and welcome to our April auction market wrap. Okay, there's no sugarcoating it. Over the past four weeks, we've noticed a big change in the Sydney property market and it's been a very rapid change as well. The two main reasons for that is the fact that we have the upcoming election, but also interest rate rises. Now, furthermore, owner expectation probably hasn't yet caught up with the fact that there has been a shift in the market. But as we progress into May, we hope that the sales that take place will give owners a great understanding of where their property is positioned. And we'd really encourage agents who are listing property now to go back and reappraise those, just to make sure you're coming to market with the most accurate price guide. Now, regardless of all these changes, there's still been some wonderful results. Let's now take a look at all the stats that Teen Avenue enjoyed over April. We conducted 107 auctions, and we also saw the clearance rate drop back to 55%. But it's also important to remember a typical Sydney real estate market is a clearance between 50 and 60%. And we also noticed fewer buyers competing. We averaged 3.3 bidders, an average of 14 bids, and for the first time in over four years, we saw the percentage stat of property that sell above reserve actually be a negative. So on average, 1% below reserve was achieved over the month of April. Now, we still see a lot of property going before auction. On average, we sold 33% of property prior, but we noticed the average sale price dramatically increased to just over $2.3 million. Let's now take a look at this month's standout sale. One of my favorite sales was number 27 Martin Street in Heathcote marketed by the team at Core Property Group. This was an original family home right for renovation or for the potential to knock down and rebuild. It was positioned on a large 1,012 square meters and was walking distance to Heathcote Station and shops. Now the reserve was 1.2 million, six people registered, 20 bids were placed and it sold for 1,375,000, which was 175,000 above reserve. Over the years, I've really noticed that when the market softens, we tend to see fewer properties go to auction and more private treaty sales occur. I think it's really important to understand that auction is a process. It's not just about getting to auction day, having loads of buyers, loads of bids, and properties selling well above reserve. Auction is about giving your owner the best possible chance to get the best possible result in the shortest period of time. And that's what auction is all about, process. The ability to sell it before, on the day, or just after. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for tuning into our April auction market wrap. We can't wait to bring you all the results at the end of May.